What's going on guys? It's me Shugushu. We are back with another Umumusume video. And in this video, we are gonna be starting the CM preparations. Uh for this week we are just gonna test out different Umas that I feel like you guys would most likely want to um will expect me to use. <laughs> One of them being Duramente. Uh although a problem with that is I don't necessarily have a replacement speed card for her, unless you guys will see what I'm trying to test in today's video. But, um, there's the Mente, of course, I do want to try New Year's Kita, uh, shoot, even normal Teo or, yeah, Gentle Donna is probably, probably a most likely because, you know, <laughs> why wouldn't I want to use her for medium distance when he's like built for that basically. So yeah. <laughs> so we might be looking at for sure gentle donna and a debuffer we'll, we'll say like 90 percent, but we'll see if i can come up with uh, a better one for that it's it's whoever i i can train the best within the now and the cm but that this week i'm just gonna be pretty much just testing out different characters not really um the set team besides i guess the the debuffer which would either be i guess nice nature or grass wonder i think one of those two so yeah other than that i haven't done a run since before friday's video um the last run i had was sitting here was Duramente's, and it was there for like four days right yeah basically the whole weekend from starting from friday and yesterday and <laughs> Yes, it was still here when I was about to record. And now I'm back to her training her because I didn't finish that one. So, yeah. <laughs> I haven't trained in like pretty much five days, if anything. But it is what it is. Things come up and this weekend I really had to... Uh, the free time I had um, in the middle of the day and all that pretty much just went towards... Uh, recording for Zenless and Weathering Waves, so yeah, I even nearly forgot to do the League of Heroes on Saturday night before it disappeared. Right? Yeah, <laughs> I forgot to do that. So yeah, this weekend was a mess. <laughs> but anyways, this is what I'm what I meant by me testing because I am back to the two guts setup. And the biggest test here is simply using my <laughs> no limit break still in love. Yeah, because my Duramente card, sadly, we can't use. There is the Kita card, but I just wanted to see. I just wanted to see how it will do if I just went with the still in love card. <laughs> so will I be able to? I don't know do well <laughs> or will i fall back really far back <laughs> because i am only using one speed card and two guts we'll see we'll see um but yeah <laughs> that is pretty much it um yeah i'm not using the nishino flower card because i do have the admire vega power card for chasers so to i guess complement the rest of my chasers chaser cards besides the haru card because i literally i mean <laughs> unless you want me to use the or fur card now we're literally testing even more but yeah unless you want me to use my one lb or fur then i mean i could try it out on my own time i, I don't mind trying it out um but yeah i'm gonna see if i can make it work this month um for the cm hopefully if not uh then i'm just hoping i can do way more trainings than i can at least because yeah <laughs> but more on that later or if i if i remember or if there's time but regardless of that that's pretty much my setup a whole basically chaser build i guess <laughs> 
I guess, besides Haru, she's just there for stats and energy. But besides of that, that's going to be all for the setup. Uh, if I seem a little off or uh, it's a little slow, <laughs> I'm a tired man right now. So, well, I've been for the past five days, pretty much. So, yeah, I don't know if you could see in my eyes. But my eye bags has been getting worse the past couple of days. Worse than me, I'm doing more multiple run, more runs in a day than yeah. So it is what it is. But uh, before we go into the training and into the comments, if you guys haven't joined a circle or you guys are looking for a circle to join, feel free to join the circle that I'm in. It is called Shushu. Once you give that a search. Hit request to join. It'll let me know that you want to join. And after that, either go to the Discord server, which the link is also down in the description below. Um, not also, but it is down in the description below. And there is a channel called Circle Request. Go over there and either in the comment section or the, in the channel. Let me know that you sent the request and, um, and your in-game name just so I can make sure that I add you and not someone else so i told you guys my mind ain't right right now or at least i don't know i if you guys are wondering if i did sleep before this i did take i did take a little nap we're good <laughs> we're good as long as i'm functioning we're good uh but let's see here let me load up the comments right here and then i think it should be good Thank. oh wait i want this to be here and then let this do the first one. Oh. And then. All right. So uh, as per usual, the first couple comments are not couple. It's it's actually more than a couple. <laughs> but the first comments are gonna be from Nova. Maybe I should run Wedding Maya to compete with Halloween one. I want to see people get steamrolled by the ancient Umas. Uh, and then Seafall responded saying, then better use base Maya to deal with an even more ancient one. Does have a point. Does have a point. That'd be more of an ancient one. Plus, on top of that, it was a two? It was either a two or one star. I don't remember. I think it was a two star. It's been so long. I can't even remember my top guns, the original outfit. I think it's a two star originally, but does make a point. Does make a point. <laughs> Although I'm pretty sure he would rather use the wedding one. Or. I guess <laughs> I was gonna say or maybe um just use Umas that were just one stars that are probably now five stars because <laughs> those are well most of them are technically ancient Umas right um hmm she, she was on this guts card for way too long I sense a pulling session I mean can you blame me <laughs> I see something good in that guts card, so I had to really take a look at it. But it is a really good chaser focus when with the cards I do have, I have to, you know, put into consideration, you know? <laughs> and then he says, I was right. Well, I had to at least try to pull or so or whatever I did. Yeah, I think it was like 13, 14 pulls, I think. No way. Was that 6%? Guys. Guys. <laughs> Was that 6%? So now it's going to be 6%, 4%, and 1%. I'm still going to go for this 5%. Alright. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. Um, This chaser card is quite good, but I'm still... I think I'm still passing. I'm not a chaser main, so I don't see how beneficial this card will be in the long run. Remember, hoarding. Hoarding saves rocks. Let's see. Let's 
funny thing is, the main chaser uh, I use, well, I think the most used chasers would that I've used would have to be between Ishii Amazon and Narita Taishin from before, because I did train her a lot before. Um, the reason why I didn't really train Duramente is because I feel like she would be better off in like medium distance, in my head at least. So that's the reason why we didn't really see her in the short mile stuff, because or the mile stuff, because I'd rather use what I had. Or, yeah. <laughs> um. But yeah, I don't technically, I, I not technically, I don't, I don't really see myself as one who only uses chasers. Obviously, y'all see me use Kita and a lot of other escapes and leaders. So <laughs> those definitely outweigh the amount of chasers I use, even if I would include the Remense in that list and Mr. CB. Which, I haven't trained Mr. CB in a long time, but she could be a pretty good consideration for me to use in this CM, simply because of my cards by on its own. So I could be use my Duramente Speed card, and then probably instead, or yeah, I could use the Duramente Speed card, and still, instead of the... Hold on, my head. <laughs> I'm trying to think. I lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah. Instead of using my Kita card, I could still use that uh, Still in Love speed card and see uh, how it will do while using a Duramente card along with it. Unlike today, where I am just using it solo, but having two Gus cards. So we'll see what happens. It is, is, it's going to take a lot of different runs for me to find the right one, I guess. But I don't mind doing multiple runs because one i want i need to make up for the past couple days because i'm pretty sure <laughs> i already know already but yeah <laughs> i already know someone someone's gonna say some something <laughs> someone specifically when i when a eugen will post a specific comment <laughs> and it unfortunately had to happen around this time but it is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is, to be honest. Uh, this should rest. Screw it. Can I just call that Uma Maki? I'm pretty sure her name originated from a devil worshipping cult. No way can. No way anyone can say that without getting cursed. I tried to say, but I feel very cursed afterwards. <laughs> I know, y'all were trying to say it on the VC chat. I simply just kept calling her Fuku to begin with. Um, Once I realized trying to say her name off the top of my head would probably sound like me just going for a tongue twister in the middle of a video if I were to say her name. <laughs> Yeah, that is probably the only Uma name where it is, it's definitely like a tongue twister, to me at least, because come on, man. Was it Machikane Fukukitaru? Something like that? Yeah, I could, I just called her Fuku. It's fine. <laughs> um, Where's the comments? There it is. What's great about Shorekeeper's Ascension materials is that there's a plant called Nova. Yes, I forgot to mention that in the last video. It, it wasn't even... <laughs> I totally forgot about it when I was recording yesterday. But yes, when I first saw the Ascension flower called Nova, I was like, well, he's probably going to mention that. And yes, you did, because I forgot to mention it. <laughs> It's cool. But yeah, it, it was it was quite funny to see it called Nova. I really like the plant design though. It's purdy purdy. 
Do I want to do this or should I just rest? I mean, it's fine. I probably should rest, but it's fine. Uh, skipping Yuhu, despite being a blue archive player, I did use her a bit during the trial phase. Her playstyle is so weird, but I can see why. Kuro wants to attract the blue archive crowd who cries a lot. Um, looking at what she is, she does like everything. Like she is a damage dealer, a supporter, and she can also support herself and also a healer. It's weird when I looked into her and I was just like, yeah, I still don't want to pull for her though. <laughs> you know? Uh, still need to catch up on Zenless. Why oh why in the year of our of our in 2024? Just that's literally how it read. I don't know if that's how you wrote it or you forgot to put the word, but or the name. <laughs> um do we still have such long storylines? Back in my day, Angry Burb and Candy Crush had no lore. Well, those are two completely different games, my friend. <laughs> They may have no lore, but story games still end back in the day were pretty long. So, unless you didn't really play story games, that's a whole different story. Or story, RPG games, the RPG. So, I, so yeah. <laughs> to compare them to Angry Birds and Candy Crush, that is one big comparison. <laughs> From Zenless to Angry Birds. No. <laughs> I just open the app and go ham. With that being said, I still need to pull for Caesar. I will see what luck Shushu has with the shortkeeper to see if the Eugen ritual will work or not. Um, yeah, there's a video for that. I was gonna say what I what happened, but there's a video for that, guys. So if you're interested, uh, go ahead and and check it out. <laughs> it was posted yesterday. Today should be actually the updated story. So yeah, I still need to um make a thumbnail and everything for that. It's not, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, three to five runs on Uma. Holy, I almost fainted when I heard that. <laughs> Man, casual shoe shoe strikes again. Well, with what happened over the weekend, yes, three to five runs would have to do for me to make up for that. <laughs> so yeah, I, I didn't stutter, did I? I? I did say three to five. As uh, compared to some people, I pro I most likely require more uh, trial runs. So we'll just we'll just leave it at that. I went to Pity back to back before in Princess Connect. This is the first time I haven't gone to Pity in a while. I see. So <laughs> this is this is what happens when it doesn't sound like you you care. I mean, I know it's it's through me reading text, but. Just reading it out loud and seeing how it's it was written or typed out, it already looked like you weren't excited or happy about it to begin with. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, it's hard to get excited to pull every gotcha and get excited all the time. I guess it depends on the characters that you're pulling for at that time, right? <laughs> like obviously if it was a character that you like, you would be excited. Or a character you're going for, yeah. But I, I I do get it. Sometimes when I'm doing pulls in the other games and I do end up getting what I want, I'm just like, nice. And that's pretty much it. And that's that's pretty much it. Just because I'm I'm literally just sitting in my room doing my pull by myself. So <laughs> there really isn't there really isn't any I guess reason for me to like pop off on my own that'd be i mean probably a mini pop off nothing you know <laughs> too weird uh but when i pull for the sake of meta then i'm like whatever you're just a tool for me to be used <laughs> sounds about right i guess uh stamina with donna and chung uh chung li i was excited because of the hype Yeah, with both Gentle Donna and Chung Li, you were you were pretty hype about it. But yeah, those were like the only two. I was like, it was like plain, painfully obvious. Obviously, also maybe 
I don't really know how you felt about the vid looks. <laughs> I, I think you were excited. Oh, I thought I had used this on a rainbow training. I didn't. Oops. Oh, well. Yeah, I can't remember like any other banner that you were excited about, to be quite honest. I think, I think we're fine. Um, you can pay me one trillion dollars and I'm still not going to go back to global. Those days of just depression and knowing that I have no good cards besides Kita to use. Just thinking about it makes me sad. Once you tasted Japan, Japan, Japanese heaven, why would you want to try English hell? Well, the only argument I have for that is pretty much if only they had released global a little bit earlier. Not even a little bit, a lot more earlier. <laughs> a little bit earlier would not make up for how long it is now. So, like I said, whenever that happens, <laughs> whenever global happens, um, I will, I will be super casual about it. Super casual. Cause ain't no way I'm going to take global seriously when I've, I've gone gung ho with, ja with the Japanese version already. So. Uh, my League of Heroes experience this time was so forgettable because I treat it as an arena daily run. I nearly forgot, like I said, I nearly forgot to do my last eight tickets. Getting into Plat 3 was expected. Me, I barely made it, so it was kind of a surprise with what I had, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Uh, I wasn't aiming for plat 4 with the CM, not aiming for anything outside of Group B Finals 3rd place. Um, Vivalos and Dono will be used again because they are the GOAT of my account. The buffer for cheer nature. I don't have many Umas when compared to Shishu and Yujin, so I have limited options. That's fine though, I'm collecting cards now. Uh, normally I try to go for plat 4, but I, with how I was just stuck in UE, I didn't really, <laughs> I wasn't necessarily going to gun, uh, go for platform without, you know, being at least having its human UDs. So hopefully I can get a UD squeezed into this. I'm hoping so. We'll see what happens. Um. Yeah, with the CM, it all depends on what I have. If I can somehow make it to group A, that I ain't going to complain. <laughs> if I somehow make it to group A. But uh, if I don't make it to group A, then it, it was already expected <laughs> before the CM even started. So, mm. Speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh, I fought four Blue Eyes players back-to-back -back in ranked. <laughs> Uh, Blue Eyes can be meta, but not as strong as my updated Sky Striker deck. I love using this deck as someone who never learned how to Link Summon. Plus, no dudes. Link Summon is actually not that bad. Um, as for Blue Eyes, I don't think even the new Blue Eyes support is out. So, well, regardless, Blue Eyes has always been like a rogue deck. It hasn't necessarily been like in a meta meta. It's more like a rogue meta, if anything. Same thing with like the, the Dark Magician deck. And all that. Uh, even now, I think just... I don't know if you're using Pure Sky... I think you're using Pure Sky Strikers from what it sounds like. I think even Sky Strikers itself are considered rogue. But I haven't looked... I don't remember the... I don't know. Many people have different opinions. But for sure, there's, like a top, there's only like two top decks. Maybe three. But yeah, that, no, when that new Blue Eyes support comes out, I don't know, later in the, probably at the end of the year or the beginning of next year. I don't know, Blue Eyes might be cracked out again. For a bit, at least. <laughs> I don't know if it'll be as good as... Um, this. I don't know if it'll be as good as...
Oh, what I meant to say, I don't know if it's going to be um, that good that will push it more. It'll probably push it a little bit into the meta, but I don't think it'll, it'll take over like all these other uh, decks out there. So it'll, it'll definitely still try to make a name for itself. <laughs> Some people will, will bring it in in tourneys and see what happens with it. But other than that, I don't really see. But it is Master Duel, so I don't play Master Duel. I don't, I don't even... Heck, I think before the recent ban list in Master Duel, I think Maxi was still illegal, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh Oh, for this one, I think I just go for the top one, right? Because... Yeah. But other than that, thank you for all the comments, Nova. Appreciate it as always. And the next comment is going to be from uh, Eugen. <laughs> this is the comment I was talking about. Monthly circle report, no changes, and still on class D with 10,436 rank. Top six contributors for the month of September. Eugen at 42, Ron Track at 22. Good job. <laughs> Rick or Demo 74, 17.41 mil. Nice. Ren 17.4 mil. Close fight between the two. Very close fight. Uh, Nova at 15.65 mil. And then myself at Sh I was going to say at Shushu. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think I'll save for this time. Myself at 15.34 mil. That I did say I didn't train for four days or five days, pretty much. <laughs> so factoring that in, like literally, I was today is literally the first. The last four days of September, I didn't do a single run. <laughs> the last four days of September, I didn't do a single run. Yeah, I didn't even do a run for a single run since the event started also. So yeah, this is my first run since basically Thursday night, I would say. But yeah, I did get beaten by Casual Nova, according to this. I'm just reading a comment or up by one training. I don't know. I just know I didn't train for four or five days and... And that happened, so yeah. Honorable mention to Banana, SKO for, I just read it the way it was, it was said, it's okay. For contributing 10 mil, even just as a new trainer. And Tanoki had responded saying, Vindicated. Oh, <laughs> Open and close parentheses, I'm joking. But, but, but. Um, I'm going to make it my personal goal because of that specific comment to try and push myself to go for 20 to 25 mil. Thank you, Tanoki, by the way. <laughs> um, but that's pretty much it from Eugen. Thank you, Eugen and Tanoki, for replying. Uh, next comment is from Sihua. I pulled. Do I regret it? Not at the moment. <laughs> Not at the moment. But might when new scenario plus new Uma drops. On the bright side, I have a leader chaser card, and I can use it in the long run. Probably, I would say so. Um. Especially with the, if you did manage to, um, I think you did. I think I saw it on Discord. Um, where you did get the Narita Bryan card to uh, max limit break, right? That should that should last you for a while. It is a very good leader card, leader speed card, and it literally just came out. So you're looking at least, shoot. 
I would say a minimum a year, year and a half, simply because like, I mean, you see me still using my Kita card, right? <laughs> that card's ancient. So <laughs> yeah, your card's definitely fine. Perfectly fine for the long run. With the Chaser one, I'd say if... I think you only got two Limit Break. If you see yourself using a lot more Chasers in the future... I don't know. I think we'll just be fine the way it is. And just see how your account progresses in the future. I don't want to really... <laughs> Let's just see how your account progresses in the future. And see how your future pulls are. And then we'll see what happens. I think that would be better. But congrats on your polls. Um, and yeah, we'll see what happens in a new scenario, new Uma. But we'll see. You should still have enough time to save some kind of amount, I guess. Unless you, there are some things you can farm. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how much you farm in the game already. So we'll see what happens. But thank you for the comment, Seahaw. And lastly, well, let me refresh. Let me refresh. And yes, the last comment is going to be from Tanoki. The number of runs in a trial depends on how long it takes to have a decent run. Don't really tend to go for a particularly high variance run. So one to three times. Once I get the run with a respectable number of rainbows, decent inheritance, and I get all my gold skills, then trial is done. Um, And then I still do one run a day. Done. Still do one run a day, so the trial lasts half a week, but no. I don't just build once, then pack up for the month. You kind of feel it when you finish training. Uh, this is it moment. Whether that be a sharp, a sense of hitting rainbows repeat repeatedly, or a really good inheritance. I mean, that is a given. If everything's going well during the run, then sure. But for me, <laughs> that doesn't that doesn't necessarily happen too often, which, which is why I say three to five for myself. But <laughs> joking or not, joking or not, you, you've lit a fire and I am, regardless of how tired I'll be this whole whole month, I don't care anymore. <laughs> I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. It's, it's going to happen. I'm going for 20, 25 mil. If I can, 30. That's it. That is it. <laughs> Will I go back to doing that next month if I do somehow reach that? Uh, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Probably not, but we'll see. I did say just for this month, okay? But we'll see what happens in the next month. That's fine. Whatever. I'll just do that. But other than that, that is pretty much it for all the comments. So thank you, Tanoki, Tihua, Eugene, and Nova for all the comments. I appreciate it as always. I feel like it's been a while since um since I finished comments this early because I'm literally just like halfway into the run but regardless <laughs> regardless like I said thank you guys for the continuous support in the comments I appreciate it as always um uh... But yeah. I guess this I, I guess I can start talking about like possible Umas that I'll train on the side or the rest of the week. Uh we just saw I think we just saw we saw we just saw Kita. Obviously I'm gonna try to <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can get a good Kita run on my own. I don't know if I'll probably train her once this week and I'll probably be it for the rest of the month. For you guys at least. Uh, I might bring a different pair because one of the spots are definitely taken by a debuffer. So most likely I'm going to try New Year's Kita because it's Kita. Normal Teo because I feel like Normal Teo has been the best, the better one. Um... At least after she got her unique skill update or whatever she when they were upgrading updating skills for the old characters 
23, I don't know if I want to go for 23. <laughs> but what if the next one... Hmm. I mean, I already lost a, a, a training once, right? Would it really hurt me to go for an, to get another one? Not like this is going to be the last attempt for me to use Duramente. So I'm going to do it. Okay. Wait, Nova, you might be onto something. Because I, I remember him saying, you know, <laughs> what if you kept going for the higher ones? But there ain't no way I'm going to get this one. There ain't no way. <laughs> I don't see it. There ain't no way. Let's just hope no rainbows. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I ain't going for 86 or 85. I'm sorry. I already get I'm like nervous with 20. <laughs> Let alone 4 and 4%. So yeah. We'll, we'll just leave it at that. We'll just leave it at that. Uh what other Umas can I potentially use on or for myself that I would want to use. Uh, obviously, I do want to use Gentle Donna. Because recent Uma built for medium distance. Why wouldn't I want to use her? So I'm going to use her. So she, like I said, she might actually take the spot. I don't know if I said it, but I'm going to say it again. She, she will probably most likely take the spot. My personal opinion. Along with maybe either a chaser. Just simply because of my cards. It might not be Duramente because I might have to use two speed cards. <laughs> I might. We'll see. Or uh, it might be Aishin, which would be okay for me not to use her card because I at least have Measure of Romano, which is still a decent enough wise card to use. And then... Uh, I wouldn't say Hishi Amazon because I do want to use her guts card as the if I'm gonna use a chaser. Any other chasers I could possibly use that I have? I mean for long distance, there is measure of bright as long as I, you know, bring her up to at least level four, I guess. But I probably would want to use her at level five instead if I'm gonna only have her at three star. Um Is there anyone else? I'd say Gold Chip, but I don't necessarily train Gold Chip. No hate to Gold Chip. It's just... <laughs> I don't really see myself using Gold Chip a lot. Uh, 32, 33... How are my plants? Plants? How am I... Uh... I was going to say 6%. You're going to do that again. Oh, what other Umas can I use? I don't think I have any other chasers that I can use or would use. I haven't even trained Measurable Bright once, so that's also another thing. Out of all the races in Duramente's schedule, this is probably the one that I'm most worried about because it's long distance. Uh, but it's okay. I'll see what I can do about it. Normally, when I do train Duramente, especially if it's not for long, well, I don't think I've ever trained her for a long distance. Uh, well, I guess with that being said, <laughs> this usually takes multiple attempts unless it goes well the first time. So we're going to be... If this doesn't work out, this is like the only thing that I'm kind of like sketched out about Duramente's run is because I'm not sure if I'm going to win this. <laughs> Do I put the small inheritance for to bring it to a B or an A? No, no. <laughs> Do I? Me personally, I don't. I want to just keep it at a C. Maybe I should have picked skills. I normally don't throughout the whole run. But this seems kind of... Yes, nothing has changed. It's just pure second place. <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is. It's funny because when I did train her before uh, last week, last week when I was training her before leaving her to wait, as in the, the runs before the one I didn't do, she won all of it. 
you won all of it. I don't know if it had to do with the difference in speed because I did have a little bit more speed than I did with this one. Or was it the stamina? I'm not too sure what it was, but it was <laughs> a little... Yeah, even then, I was stuck at second place the whole time. Whereas all the other runs I did with Duramente last week, it was bouncing between second, third, sometimes fourth, then back to third. So I wasn't too sure. <laughs> but then it would go go to first eventually. This one was just second place or just second place. Oh well. Uh, but I'll 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 try to. I'm gonna squeeze in another run or so for today. Also, I need to go over a circle as well. Yeah, I could have done that over the weekend and all that, but like I said, I didn't do I didn't do anything pretty much Uma related. But as for other chasers, I don't think I have much to be honest. Like Dream Journey could have been an option, but I don't have her. The Randall, but she's only short mile, right? Um do have Measurable Bright, but I'd say only for long distance if I were to use her. Is she Amazon is a no because I want to use her her guts card. It's just CB, I, like I said. I do have Steampunk Taishin, but I, f I haven't really used her. <laughs> I haven't really used her. Do I have Admire Vega? I don't think so. I don't think so. I do have Tomomo Cross, but I don't, I don't, I don't want to use her. So yeah, I don't really have much chasers that I can use. Can I just train an Uma as a chaser? As in, through Inheritance? Yes, I can, but I just want to I want to have my inheritance just focus on medium distance, pretty much, so most likely not. Stamina is looking pretty low, so I might consider two power cards. I might. Uh, if not, then we'll see what happens. <laughs> might consider two power cards, actually. But we'll see. Either that or I give more of an inheritance towards... Um, stamina, because even though it does have majority, and some of the, I think it's on also on power and speed, it's not really getting much of rainbow trainings, as well as, yeah, I just haven't really seen rainbow trainings for it as well. Other than that, um, I mean, this run was pretty much, to me at least, well, if it wasn't already, then, yeah, it was already dead to me because of the failed training early on. Yes, <laughs> I thought about that early already. And on top of that, we, we, we didn't win the Kika show, so that's fine. This run, eh, it is what it is, I'd say. I just realized I haven't even done all much of <laughs> Yeah, I'm out of it. Or maybe because um Yeah. It's just <laughs> I'm out of it, guys. We'll just leave it at that. 
there's no way else for me to explain it where my mind is just jumping from place to place or it's not i'm not able to keep my train of thought that fast <laughs> for some odd reason at this moment i wish there was more comments to <laughs> keep my attention on rather than me losing my train of thought and all that but oh i guess another option i can use is technically a gurry cap <laughs> I do want to use a Guri Cap, and I did mention I did want to train Simbly Rudolph. I guess depending on which one, I'll use the Festival one for the long distance, or and then the normal one for medium distance, probably. Other possibilities, well... What other possibilities? Agnes Tachyon, like I said. Uh, I would say Cheval Grand, but she needs 2400. That's the only issue I have. Hers is way more, more specific. I would have done Festival Teo if I had her, or tried Festival Teo if I tried, if I had her. Uh, Romano would be, our, wouldn't be bad. But it's like I said, it's... There's a, there's a lot of options to use for medium distance. I just don't know. I just don't know who I would use. But for sure, we're looking at one debuffer at least. <laughs> yes, I say at least even though it's for sure, but... Yeah, it'll, it'll either be Nature or Grass Wonder. I don't know if I have any other... I probably do, but I'm not sure if I do. Uh, 34. I do that, or... Hmm... We'll do Guts. Yeah, I don't think this run was good at any way from the beginning. I never... I didn't have a good impression from the start. So... But I think I will try this specific setup a couple more times. Simply because... Probably not. <laughs> now, I will try it a couple more times because I feel like it. I won't be able to fully judge my this two guts attempt without really doing a couple more runs. So it, it's just honestly specifically for Duramente because, uh, because of the speed card situation. So far, it seems OK, but being only at, I guess, Pretty much 1200. It, I'm not too sure. So, yeah. I might. Hmm. I might need to find a way to do something <laughs> to help me multitask on Pretty Derby more. Yes, you can. You guys can see that I'm scheming or planning how to push myself to go get the minimum 20, but max 30 mil. For the, for the month. <laughs> kind of scheming about it. Will I make it happen? It all depends on... On me. Not even if I get... Not even on my... On... It, whether or not I can do it. It all just depends on me. Because even if things do come up and all that. Or I get more busier than normal. 
it all depends if I still put in the time to do the extra trains, which I normally would put in put in the effort for. But now that I kind of, for myself at least, puts <laughs> put uh that kind of I don't know what to call it really. Is it pressure? I I guess I can call it. I don't know pressure, some kind of motivation. I don't know. If I put something like that on me for the month, where I put have to reach a certain amount, then I, I think I'd be more motivated. I did say that I wanted to beat my last month's account, and I did. <laughs> Technically did, so being 15 mil. So, yeah, I guess that's fine. Plus, I did reach also my UD goal for the scenario, so... Uh, I think it's safe to say that I can just push myself even more. Regardless of me being tired or not. I think. <laughs> but yeah. I'll try to reach 20, but I'll try to... Even if I do reach 20, I'll probably still try to push for 30. Regardless. Because, obviously, I would want to push for higher. <laughs> I mean, if I reach 20 early on, then there's really no reason for me to stop training. <laughs> Especially if I still need to keep training for the CM. Or prepping for the CM. I might actually... There's a small consideration here in trying to use a stamina card. But when I did train a stamina card... Uh, when I was training for the CM... It already reached a thousand way earlier than I wanted it to. Either that or I get rid of the stamina inheritance. Then that would be a whole different story. But well, I don't know. I don't know. That's the only thing. Which is why I need to do my <laughs> my multiple runs. Although, I will for sure try, like, the different pacers, as in Mr. CB most likely, and, no, I'll even try Taishin, but, I will still train the other Umas as well. But tomorrow, I think we'll try Kita, just because I want to try Kita. Dang, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't get the event change for this. That's quite unfortunate. <laughs> that, that is quite unfortunate. I think I'll be okay. Let's get this up to three. Yeah, let's just get that up to three. But... See, the rest of the week, Kita. We'll do Gentle Donna next week. Because I feel like she's the for sure one. So maybe we'll squeeze in Teo, Kita. Screw up, maybe either Mr. CB or Taishin just to see the whole me using a Dormente card as beat card. And then. Just one more. Who else can I use? Cap, maybe? Cap, maybe? Rudolph, maybe? Not too sure. One of those. I don't have any of these, but at least I can still get this. We are almost to the thing, but regardless, I most likely won't use this one because it was a failed training and all that. 
Failed training. The failed race. Yes, it's a failed race. <laughs> uh, normally, I'd go for the energy, but since I do want to use that last date, which I can use now. <laughs> I can use now instead. You know what? I will. I'm going to just get it out of the way now. And then... Oh, yeah, it's October now, too. Huh. I need to take a look at Steam. Maybe there's a horror game I haven't played that I could squeeze in. Let's see. I mean, there are some, but... Mm. Oh, there is that one. Maybe. Maybe. I do have one in mind. But is it necessarily... I think... Mm. Or I can go back and... Ooh, Silent Hill 2 comes out soon. Silent Hill 2 comes out soon. Hmm. <laughs> this is quite... Did I? I don't remember if I had used... Did I cook there? I don't even know. The only reason why that came up in my mind is because uh, I have Silent Hill Homecoming on my PC, and I did like playing that one. I think Silent Hill 2 releases on the 6th or 7th, or maybe later. I'm not sure. I am not quite sure. I don't have enough speed. I literally screwed that up. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Let's see. When does it come out? Yeah, October 7th. Hmm. Next Monday. Can I squeeze in? Can I squeeze in Silent Hill? I want to play a horror game. To be honest. What other games haven't I played here? That I probably should. Ooh, I forgot. Little Nightmares 3 comes out next year, I think. I don't really know. But maybe. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, was there another... What was this one? There most likely was... I could do Fears to Fathom. Since I think there's a fourth one. I think. Or a fourth and fifth one. Yeah, episode five is out now. That could be another game. So basically another hundred.
Hmm, I'll probably take a look at the Steam list or Steam store then. See if I'll. See if, if I can find a couple more. But I'm pretty down for Silent Hill, not gonna lie. Let me see. Steam turn RPG fast. Maybe later on they'll have. Maybe, I don't know. They'll have horror games for sale. <laughs> Maybe. Doubt it, but. Oh, boy, Tecmo has. Hmm. Let's do this. I do need to save enough for the next ones, the next, the last training, so. That'll for sure get that out of the way. That'll for sure get that out of the way. Hmm. Honestly, I could see the two guts working if things go well. Because this is definitely looking better. I'm not really. What do I mean looking better? What I meant to say is, uh, I don't know. It doesn't look any better, to be quite honest. Because the speed is pretty low. The speed was a little bit higher than, yeah. But compared to what I was doing last week, when I was training Gentle Donna, trying to push her to UD, which... And then... Yeah, it, it there was a complete difference here with the two speed and the two... Guts and L, but... Uh, I will try with, I guess, Kita Speed card, but I think, I think the Still in Love solo card, even it not being max limit or limit broken, I think it still did fairly all right. It's just, I don't know. I just, I just need the Rainbow Trainees to work in my favor, I guess. It's the only way I could see it. Yeah, plus I need to uh, tweak. Uh, tweak the stamina and figure it out. Either I go two power, maybe, or because technically I can go two power. Yeah, technically I can go two power with um, Inishino no flower one. So yeah, I, I can try that as well, but I think Dormante has um, power in her growth rate though, right? So I don't think I have to use two powers, but the reason why I want to use two powers is so I can bring up stamina instead of bringing a stamina card. So that's, that's the reason. Hey, happy me. Right, that's one training. First training of October. Many more to go. This one I could see being at least a low UE, but it could still be a high UF for some odd reason. <laughs> Although all my stats should have, besides, yeah, I just don't know how I feel about it. I'm picking up my gold skills first, just in case you guys were wondering. And then I go back to pick out the others. Although, or, and also these skills, because I normally would pick them anyway.
Okay, no more gold skills up here. All right. Uh, corner. Great. Acceleration. Maybe. Sixty, can I squeeze that in? Eighty-eight. Mm. Not even the green skills. Ooh. I guess that's it. It's nothing else for me to pick. But we'll just leave it at that. But we ended off with fourteen eighty-one speed, which isn't too bad. If I can get a little bit more, obviously, then yeah, I can get it to seventeen hundred. Stamina might have to run two power, but I don't know how I feel about running two power on Duramente. I think it'll be okay. I think I'll run two power and give it a shot uh, on my own time. But other than that, yeah, we ended off at 1481 speed, 702 stamina, 1253 power, 1316 guts, and 1239 on wise with an S aptitude on medium distance. Let's do this and that. Leave these be because we don't need them. UE1. At least my first training of October wasn't a U U F. <laughs> I would have hated that. But yeah, nothing special. Nothing special. Uh, it's just, it was, it was a test run. I need to do this a couple more times before I can, uh, say that it, I don't want to do this setup anymore. <laughs> so yeah, with that being said, guys, that is going to be the end of this video. If you guys did make it this far, I do want to say thank you. You guys can hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, subscribe button, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys thought of the run. Obviously. It was a trial run, test run with two Guts cards because I wanted to try it out. So it wasn't the best. Plus, we did we did lose the Kika show and also got a fail training at 6% in the beginning of this training. So knowing that, I'm, I'm, I have to keep trying. <laughs> but if there's anything else you guys do want to talk about or ask me, if it, as long as you keep it appropriate, I'll go over it. If you guys haven't joined the Discord server, link is down in the description down below. And if you guys haven't joined a circle or you guys are looking for a circle to join, feel free to join the circle that I'm in. It is called Shushu. Once you give that a search hit, request join, it'll let me know that you want to join. But other than but besides that, go back to the comment section. Or go to the Discord server. There is a channel rec circle request channels, and you can either go there or the comment section and let me know that you sent the request along with your in game name, just so I can make sure that I accept you into the circle and not someone else. But with that being said, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you once again, and as always, I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.